After so many years of your effort and our effort, I really look forward to passing a nursing staffing bill this year so that we can get you the breaks you deserve. And I think in large part because of your efforts and your advocacy and your gentle persuasion, <laughs> we're going to look forward to getting that job done. I just want to share with you why I have supported this effort uh, for some time and do wholeheartedly this year. Uh, I formed my view about your profession when I was 10 years of age. I had a, a broken leg and I had some surgery in a hospital in Renton and I was in a hospital for a while uh, recovering. And in my room, we used to have four patients to the room, right? There was a young man who'd been badly burned. His mother had tipped over a pot of boiling oil. She was making donuts on him and he had some bad burns and you know how much pain is involved in that. And he, um, he repeatedly, through the days I was in the room with him, when he was in distress, he would call for Mrs. Lemon. Mrs. Lemon, can you come help me? And in my mind, she came to him every half hour for four days. And I really remember that. And that has always stuck with me. And she gave him uh, comfort. And I just remember that. And I think it is right now, finally in 2019, you know, 60 or 55 years later, we finally got a bill to protect the Mrs. Lemons of the world. And I'm glad we're going to get that done. So I want to thank you for what you've done.